welcome to my channel. I have a giant Woolworths haul for you for my family of seven. This is for about a week's worth of groceries, six to seven days, depending on how far we get. I've just gotten back from my grocery pickup. I am in Canberra. It is the 16th. Yes, it is. It's the 16th of December, which is summer. And I am wearing a jumper because this week has been absolutely freezing in Canberra. I have never experienced an Australian summer like this, but the Canberrans tell me, my fellow Canberrans tell me that this is not normal. And so I have hope for next year that we'll get a proper summer, but it is cold. And here I am with a nice cup of coffee. I'm gonna show you what I got. Well, it's a big one today. And then I will put my meal plan in at the end and the totals at the very end. Can I just say before I get started that, oh my goodness, the car parking for getting the groceries today, it's school holidays. And this is our first year in Canberra. And up until now, I have hardly, maybe like once in the whole year we've been here, have I experienced any road rage. I experienced like all of it, like the year's worth in the car parking today. People were absolutely crazy. Um, I, I had people beeping at me, people were beeping at each other. It was pretty full on. Anyway, so I went on a big adventure to get these groceries. That's what I'm trying to say. So I'll show you what I got. I've tried to put things in order, but I've just noticed that they are not. Okay, we've got some mushrooms, just the little uh, baby cucumbers. I really wish I could get to Costco. I just simply have not had the chance or the budget at the moment because everything's going into Christmas and so I'm not buying anything in bulk. But we've got the baby cucumbers. Costco has a big, big tub of them and we love those. So we've just got the little ones. Um, I've got four cuts of pumpkin. So I've got the butternut and the can. That's this Miss May coming in uh, for pumpkin soup this week. We've got a bag of avocados. I've just got two of these four pack each of peaches in juice. We've got uh, two mini rumor tomatoes, two cartons of that, just the odd bunch of apples, which are green ones this week. Also the odd bunch of pears. I've got a lot of bananas. We get bananas every single week. Okay, here's some icing sugar. I probably should put that over here. with so all the baking stuff, which I'll get to in a minute, along with all of this. So we've got, I didn't need to buy too much meat this week um, because it's a bit of a different week meal-wise, but I've got the one kilo of beef mince and the 800 grams of pork mince. Let me go this way. I've got my gluten-free dinner rolls because we're going to be having some soup this week. So I've got the normal dinner rolls for the other members of our family and I'm sure I will not eat all of these dinner rolls. So they can have those as well, but I can have one or two for me and also my free from gluten white bread. Uh, then I've just got the regular uh, Woolworths Essentials white bread, some wholemeal bread and there is two of the Mighty Soft Raisin Toast. May's going outside. I'm not sure she came in to get something. I don't know what she got. We've just got some of this Western Star spreadable butter. That is so good. Some sour cream. I've gotten six tubs of the Chobani. The strawberry and the blueberry are my favorites. So, I mean, I will happily have all of those, but I'm happy to share those as well. Um, we've got some whipped cream, some thickened cream. Dave, oh. It's really hard to see through my screen. Here we are. Dave really likes that Chobani. And then we've just got the family Yo Play 12 pack of yogurt. We have 12 liters of full cream milk. We have eight bottles of the 1.25 sparkling water. I have found that Dave and I really love that, but we have guests over quite a bit and they seem to really enjoy that too. So it's just nice to have that on hand to offer sparkling water to people. Okay, let me go back this way. I'm all over the place today. I apologize. Where are we? Did I say garlic and blueberries? I'm not sure. We have some frozen blueberries and some garlic. We have the reindeer carrots. Very good this time of year. Uh, nectarines. Yay! Woolworths <laughs> is finally showing some of the summer fruits. But this was the only one I got. Cherries were there, but they were so expensive. And we were so blessed this week with a beautiful lady from our church dropping by two big bags of mangoes. So I didn't need to get any more summer fruits, but so happy we got some nectarines. I got three cartons of the free range eggs. I've also got a bag of onions. We've just got foil. Um, the two kilos of whitewashed potatoes. They were only $5 for the two kilos. I thought that was good. The quelch, ice blocks, different flavors this week. We usually get the other ones, but that's good. It's nice to change it up a little bit. We've got three packets of baby wipes, just some dry dog food. He doesn't have that 
like every day because he, he gets quite bloated and thirsty, but it is nice just to have it as a, a filler on hand. So we've got that dry dog food there and then he's got four cans of dog food and then he usually just eats human food because we have a lot of little kids and he he gets his share, so it's all good. We've just got the Canberra Gold Milk as well, um, the 15 packet of Shapes and just some honey poppers, disinfection wipes, just the really cheap um, toilet paper. What brand is this actually? It's so cheap. I think it's only two ply, which is fine. Like, I mean, I'm here I am talking about toilet paper. I don't know if this is everyone's favorite subject, but the two ply seems to work just as well. And it's like half the price of the other toilet paper. Now these Quilton tissues, I did not actually order, but more than happy to have those. I'm sure they will go to good use. Um, just the palm olive. Uh, I wash a lot of dishes, a lot of dishes in my life. And this one is just a bit more gentle on the hands and it smells beautiful. I love the original smell. And also just the multi-purpose lavender spray. Where are we? We've just got 20 packs of the 250 uh, bottles of water that'll come in handy. We're actually about to hop in the car and drive to Sydney this afternoon. So that's great for the kids to have just the little bottles of water when we go out. Um, two bottles of Pepsi Max. Let me see here. We've got this. Um, this is the bigger uh, bag. I was trying to get the measurement for you. Uh, one, oops, something fell off. 1.5 kilos of quick oats. Just some sponges as well. Oh, I didn't show you. I've just seen it on the phone. These tissues I did order. So I ordered the Woolworths ones, which are the cheap, cheapo. Uh, and I got those, but then they also gave me two boxes of the very nice, extra thick, three ply soft tissues. Okay, we've got the steamed veggies, just the all green one, and then the broccoli, carrot, and sugar snap as well. We're heading down, we're getting through it. We've got some mixed veg. Where are we? Okay. I've got two packets of the thick egg noodles that will be for spaghetti, but as I'm trying to lower my gluten intake again, I've just got some rice noodles as well. I know that it's not spaghetti, but I mean, it's not zoodles either, if you know what I mean. So <laughs> I'm still I'm still eating something. Um, we've just got the Polsky Agorki, the dill cucumbers. We have got, okay, would anyone care to guess what I might be making with some of these ingredients. We are going to be getting into all of our Christmas baking next week. So I am not a baker. I want to be so badly and I try all the time, but I just feel like with every attempt, we get better and better. So look, it's chocolate, right? It's going to taste good no matter what. So we've got some white baking chocolate. We've got some dark cooking chocolate and some milk chocolate. I should mention the family cheese block hiding under there as well. Um, we've got some marshmallows. The kids have not seen these yet, but we'll be so thrilled. I have a couple ideas of what we might do with that. We also have some salted peanuts. We've got some almond essence. I've got granulated, I mean raw sugar to color that to be able to decorate some cookies. I've got some walnuts, some cooking butter. I've got all the flowers in the world. Okay, that's the icing mixture we saw before. I've got some self-raising flour. I've got some plain flour. I thought that I, I got gluten-free flour, but I didn't, but that's okay. It's Christmas. As I said, I'm slowly coming up. We've got the Allen's uh, ripe raspberries. I've got some coconut oil. I've also got two cans of the Sweden condensed milk. Okay, getting what fell off. Just little snacks. These were two for six for the Pringles and the Doritos. That sale's been on for a while now. Just some sweet and salty popcorn, uh, microwave popcorn. And then I really wanted to get the Woolworths uh, version of the popcorn bags, but they have been out of stock for about three weeks. So I just got the cobs. There's five packs in each, so sea salt and lightly sweetened as well. I think I've mentioned everything. Did I say lentils? There's lentils there and there's rice cups. I hope that's it, guys. I'm sorry if I've missed anything. Okay, so before I tell you the meal plan, I will let you know what I'm going to attempt to be baking this week. Attempt being the main word there. I'm glad I've gotten it early so that if it doesn't work out, I can 
have time to go out and get the ingredients and try again. I would really love to be able to bring something to my parents' house and also to Dave's parents' house for Christmas next week. So we will have a go, have fun baking with the kids. So we're going to try uh, Rocky Road. I've never made our own Rocky Road before, but I have thought about it for a couple of years now and I'm like, I'm sure we can do this. So I think the only thing is I'll need to go out to Kmart and get just a good silicon um, like mold thing i don't see this shows you what a great a great baker i am i don't even know the name of things but you know what i'm talking about so that it doesn't stick and everything comes out really easily so i'm gonna try rocky road i'm gonna try to do some fudge with the sweetened condensed milk and some of that chocolate definitely going to be trying to make some sugar cookies you know just the christmas cookies with the cutout shapes and that's why i've got the sugar there as well because my mom um this is my first Christmas away from my mum, and she usually does the cookies with the kids, so it's a little bit sad. Um, but my mum always gets that sugar and puts some good uh, food coloring in, like green and red, and then they decorate them. And so we'll have an attempt at that. I'm also going to try Russian tea cakes, or they're also called Mexican wedding cakes. They're basically butter and sugar. They're so good. They are so, so good. It's um, flour, butter, uh, walnuts, almond essence, icing sugar. I can't even, I, I should just link the recipe. They are so good. And they're little, they're in balls and they're dipped in powdered sugar and you bite them and it's just like, you just, yeah, you just disappear for a minute and it's just wonderful. So they are delicious. Also, what am I making? Uh, Russian tea cakes, fudge. Oh, I may attempt. We'll just see how far we get. I don't know. This is really stretching it. But with those marshmallows I'm using for the Rocky Road, we'll have heaps left over. And so we may get the rice bubbles and do the rice bubble marshmallow bars as well. So I don't know though. That's a really big gift. So for dinner, for dinners this week, I told you it's a bit of a crazy week. This is the week before Christmas. So I think I said, yeah, it's the 16th of December. Um, it's a Friday. This is coming out on Friday. So if you're watching this on the day, this is very, very real lifetime. So we are heading to Penrith, to Western Sydney. Tonight, I have my niece's birthday tomorrow. So we'll be leaving and driving through dinner time. So dinner's on the road tonight. So that's easy. And then we get back tomorrow night. It's a really quick trip. And I'm just going to do lentil soup because that's quick and easy to make up. Sunday, we have our church's really big Christmas carols in the park event. It's going to be so good. I'm really excited, but it will be an all day effort. And I know by the time we finish, we will not get out of there until I don't even know what time. It'll be nighttime. Um, we're all going to be really smashed. So there will be food at the carols. There's a sausage sizzle. There's going to be some food tracks, that sort of thing. So I'm sure between those options, we'll eat something. And if we don't, then we will absolutely get some takeaway afterwards because I ain't cooking after that. No sorry. Monday, I'll do spaghetti. Tuesday, I'm going to do some pumpkin soup with the dinner rolls. And then Wednesday, I haven't made it for a while, just some cutlet chicky. I'll use the pork mince. It's delicious. They're like rissoles. I want to do some potatoes with dill and butter. And I'd like to do um, a mushroom, a creamy mushroom sauce as well. So that is dinner for the next week, God willing. Okay, so the total, the absolute total came to $362.62, which I was really happy with, but, 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 I got a $40 discount off of that. So $30 off because my order was over, I think it was like $3.90, they would give you $30 off. And then I had $10 on my reward card as well. So $40 off. So I, I don't know. Sometimes I think, do they say $30 off if you spend $3.90 and then they increase all the prices anyway? I don't even know, but I'm not complaining. It's an expensive week because I got all those baking ingredients. Um, and I mean, it's Christmas. I think everything goes up around this time anyway. So hope you enjoyed this haul. I'm going to get going, get these groceries away and get ready to leave. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see you very soon with another video. God bless and take care. Bye.